Ah, presidential elections. A time where Americans rally together in unity and solidarity. While this is unfortunately not the case, Americans are united by the fact that they have to choose their next president. One candidate in particular stole the show during the first presidential Republican primary debate, Vivek Ramaswamy. Now that everybody's gotten their memorized, pre-prepared slogans out of the way, we can actually have a real discussion now. I'm the only person on the stage who isn't bought and paid for, so I can say this. The climate change oh, whoa, agenda whoa, 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 is a whoa, whoa. hoax. I think we do need somebody of a different generation to lead this nation forward. Unlike any president before him, Ramaswamy subscribes to Eastern religion. So I'm a Hindu. I believe in one true God. Thanks for letting me introduce myself tonight. Thank you. We went around PhD's campus to see what students and faculty think of this up-and-coming presidential hopeful. They were all what, more or less what you would expect. Candidates that stood out to me were people like uh, Chris Christie, Nikki Haley, and of course Vivek Ramaswamy. The thing that I, I like about Vivek uh, is he's, he's very young and he's very energetic. What I think Vivek Ramaswamy is trying to do is he's trying to recapture the 2016 hype around President Donald Trump. God is real. There are two genders. Fossil fuels are a requirement for human prosperity. Reverse racism is racism. An open border is not a border. I think he's direct. He's to the point. Um, he says exactly what he believes and he says what he wants to say. If he's talking about issues, love what he says. He just has to be able to control that and do that in a more statesmanlike manner. No, I don't believe that that's necessary because despite the fact that the United States is to some extent built on Judeo-Christian values, it's, I think, denying um, the image, people being made in the image of God, general revelation and common grace to say that somebody needs to have Judeo-Christian values to be able to uphold them. Can they do it? Sure. Is it what the, for, uh, the founders thought would be ideal? Absolutely not. They're very clear. Now, as, as, as an individual, the, the person I'm looking for to be the president, I personally would prefer someone who is, who does have a foundation of Judeo-Christian values. I think those are generally the values that govern Western culture. I don't think that's 100% necessary. It's not like I would not ever support a candidate who is an atheist or of another religion. While it is true that he's Hindu, um, he received a Catholic education um, and he holds to America's traditions and history and he believes that a return to this tradition and history is important in a political context. And while he's personally Hindu, he has specifically said that he's not going to be the quote pastor in chief of America. Well, the, 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 the issue would be he may uh have a uh, good moral as far as right and wrong, he won't have uh, the Holy Spirit supporting him. When we look back, many of our presidents have, haven't operated from a moral Christian perspective. And some have done a decent job being administrators, others have not, so. What it does open the door for is for Vivek Ramaswamy to take his Hindu background and undermine the Judeo-Christian uh, foundation of the United States. Now, I don't think that's necessarily going to happen if he were president. I don't think that he's shown that that would happen, but it does open the door that somebody, for somebody who's not a Christian to go against the founding principles of the country. I think that Vivek Ramaswamy is the clear choice in the 2024 um, Republican primaries as the best candidate to move forward. No, it would not be Vivek. He's probably not my first choice. Uh, he's interesting. I think he's more of a VP candidate right now. Um, so it would depend on who's on the other side, whether I'd vote for him or not. 